On experience got kids thinking about agriculture today. MTN's Elizabeth Transu takes us to the fairgrounds to see just what uh, Ag Day is all about. Agriculture, Montana's leading industry. We are an agriculture-based state, and if you're going to know, if you're going to eat the food, you might as well learn where it's coming from. But how do you get kids interested? Anybody play in the sandbox before? For over the past 10 years, the Cascade Conservation District hosts an event called Ag Days. What does wool come from? Sheep. This two-day event geared towards teaching fourth graders from all over Cascade County about agriculture. They're realizing and seeing, you know, where our products are coming from and how it helps the community and the surrounding areas. Over 700 kids visiting each of the nine stations. We're going to learn about the bees, we're learning about soil, we're learning about farming. This is really cool. Who don't even realize they are learning. When they're playing with the soil, I mean, you just see their faces just you don't realize it's soil. It's like, it's fun, but yeah, it's just, it's encouraging to see their faces and enjoy the ah moments. I love the hands-on real life experiences that they get to see. And I mean, these are the things that kids remember. They're, you know, when they're adults and that's, you know, seeing their faces light up and realizing, oh, that's, that's how this works. See what's happening right now? What's coming out the bottom? That's the flower coming out the bottom. But of course, kids will be kids. Tell me what your favorite part about Ag Day is. Uh, making ice cream, because I love ice cream so much. It just, the minute I taste chocolate ice cream, is like heaven. In Great Falls, Elizabeth Transu, MTN News. The Cascade Conservation District is looking to expand their Ag Days. That, of course, can't be done without the help of volunteers or sponsors. And if you or your business is interested in getting involved, you can visit us online for details.